What is up guys and in today's video we'll be doing another the second ever unboxing video on this channel. Now I've been really excited for this puzzle. I ordered it like a week ago and now it is finally here. I've heard lots of good things about it. Can you guess what it is? It is the Diane V2 Megamix. Okay, let's open this up. Okay. Lots of bubble wrap in here. But other than that, let's look at the cube. So, it has this. This card is a cube stand, so I guess you have to sign this QR code and I'll tell you how to fold and cut it into a cube stand. Anyways, on the... Oh, we also have this sticker from the cubicle. It says, we love that you're a customer. Probably for Valentine's Day. Okay. And... The cube head sticker, because if you use um, discount code cube head, it gives you a huge discount and a free sticker. So, take that. And now, we have the box. So, blue and black have some red on the bottom. And I'll give you the first look. Okay. So, we have the Mega Minx here, but let's review the accessories. In the accessories box, we have this bag. It's gray. It says Diane on it. Then, what else do we have? Okay, we have a screwdriver. And some springs. Let's put this off to the side, and we can finally review the cube. Okay, so it's in this kind of like a packaging here, so let me just try and tear it off. Okay, there we go. Woo! Okay, so we have the gold Diane um, logo on there. It's pretty small. Actually, let me get my other Mega Minx. I'm going to just show you the size comparison. And here it is. It is the... So I don't know what it is, but... As you can see, it is like a tiny bit smaller. But... Not that much of a significant difference. Anyways, let's do the first turns. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay, this one is super smooth compared to my other Mega Minx. It was kind of scratchy, then I added lube and it got sticky. But now, we can, for this one, some pros... It's, you can really feel the magnets. I really like this. Like, if you can open it up, you see that you can't really see the magnets. Just like my other one. Except, this one had very subtle magnets. Well, this one's a little stronger. I think I prefer that on most cubes. And, uh, one thing about this cube is it is a little bit clanky. I think it might develop some spring noises later on, but only time can tell. If you want an update, just let me know down in the comments, and maybe I'll even do a solve on that video. And in the meantime, see you later. 